YouTube, what is going on? It's your guy, Kent Poole Collects, and uh, we got a little bit of a different toy hunt today. Uh, I got a little rumor, little notification that a certain Father Christmas is coming to town, so I am expecting a figure from Four Horsemen. Can you imagine that? Me scooping up a four horsemen uh figure in 2022 uh i'm excited i think it's gonna be cool and especially this time of year had so much fun uh opening up that headless horseman definitely had a lot of fun with that figure so now father christmas coming from the uh, figure Obscurus, which uh, they're doing some fun things with that line. We'll also have, um, oh, why can't I think of its name now? The little creature, the uh, Krumpus, yeah, eventually coming this holiday season. So a lot of holiday figures, uh, we've been, we're in the mood, we're in the, in the hole. But I wanted to add some things to Father Christmas. We are out on the hunt and we're gonna see if we can find some different things to kind of build diorama, display our Father Christmas figure. So come along, it'll be somewhat of our toy hunt, but we are on the search for what we can kind of put together with our Father Christmas figure. Eventually, we'll get back to the toy garage and we'll kind of put it all together so you can kind of see the display and what we kind of finally come to and open the figure. That seems like a lot. I'm explaining a lot. You all know how uh, toy channels work. We're either showing you what's out there or what... <laughs> reviewing things right so let's go see what we can find if you haven't already jump into Ken Poole collects uh, we do a lot of toy hunting we do some reviews we go to toy shows we go to cons but mostly inventory show you what is in the Carolinas so jump on in join us hit that button subscribe turn on those notifications so you don't miss a single video I get a lot of my Mythic Legions from Big Bad Toy Store, so check out Big Bad Toy Store, link in the description. Mythic Legions, Marvel Legends, G.I. Joe Classified Series, Valverse Action Force, Hot Toys, there is a ton of stuff on Big Bad Toy Store, go check them out. If you want to help out the channel, just hit the link, take a look around. You don't even have to buy anything. So, Big Bad Toy Store, link in the description. We are on the hunt, I think. Yes, we are going to Matthews, North Carolina. I think they got the shops where uh, I wanna take a look. So, join me, Matthews, North Carolina. Here we go. Well, I'm all for Christmas. All the happy smiles and the wishes. And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. North Carolina, we're going to start off at the old Hobby Lobby. Uh, I haven't been in a minute, but every once in a while we can find like some cool diorama stuff for uh, 112 scale and other customs. We also got uh, Ollie's here at Matthews, so we're going to check out both shops and... Uh, Maybe we'll find some good stuff today. Let's go see. There's so much Christmas and holiday stuff going on. I am trying to find a Santa Claus. Well, we got Father Christmas coming. So we are trying to find a sleigh to kind of match up with our 112th figure. And just a lot of stuff. We're gonna keep looking around and uh, see what we're looking for. 
kinds of uh, little trees if you wanted to kind of spruce up your diorama with a little tree scene uh, different colors and you can do a little more natural or something more decorated little uh, little ball little stars on there uh, a lot of announcements there are a lot of people in the store today too so let's keep looking around and uh, switch it up got like a little frosty maybe uh four horsemen will give us a snowman eventually but uh that would be kind of fun with our santa claus they have some different options or just like the little merry christmas sign with the display that could be fun you can see they got quite a bit going on sale wise there's some more trees you could do like a big old gift box there but a lot of options so we're gonna keep looking around all right so our sleigh hunt this is pretty cool this is kind of like a metal $24.99 you can see kind of the dimensions there but yeah we could have fun with this uh, maybe a little big for our Santa but uh, you know Santa probably has a pretty good size sleigh we could maybe add some different uh, gifts presents that uh, come with the figure or do some different 112 items so we'll take a look around but that might be an option this is a cool little wagon wow you got uh, like the christmas tree and apparently it's wagons <laughs> i didn't realize they were like connected to each other let me see if i can save this other one wow this is uh very interesting i guess uh, i am out of my element Whew, that uh that was close it's like christmas wagon nunchucks i guess there's like a light up feature wow i don't know why these are connected that is so weird but yeah, that just, uh, that just happened. <laughs> uh, maybe not the best option now that I like pulled it off of the shelf and everything, but try me. Okay, let's see. Oh, okay, so that's cool. Little light up feature there. Let's keep looking around. If you are creative, uh, Hobby Lobby, definitely a lot of opportunities. Look at all the different paints and everything. Uh, yeah, brushes, a lot of things that you can scoop up at Hobby Lobby, uh, especially if you're doing customs, building different things, some of your different sprays and all kinds of good stuff for uh, customs. You just uh, definitely got to have that imagination cap on and uh, be willing to put in a little bit of work. But Hobby Lobby, definitely a great option if you are uh, trying to build something, trying to put something together. You can find like Marvel Legends, but check out some of the different cars that they have available. Look at this thing. That is uh, pretty cool to see. A battle battalion, kind of like the Jeep there. So definitely some different uh, cars than we see at some of our other stores. Look at this big old uh, unit. That's pretty cool. Some cars that we do see at our other stores. And you're also going to get a ton of different model kits. Jolly Roger. Got our little space Star Trek there. Little tanks going on. Uh, they have a lot of like Gundam sets as well. So definitely some different things to consider. There's our little Infinity. So that's cool. Got a couple of our anime figures as well. Statues. Oh, my hero well check this out i was not expecting a mcfarlane two-pack 
I did know that uh, they have the Funko Pops, and look at our little Sailor Moon figures there. All right, let me uh, take a final look around, and uh, we'll see what we're picking up today. Found some different options. We got like this silver looking sleigh, which is a pretty good size for probably 112 scale. Uh, if you want to go 1 6 scale, they got a big old sleigh. This one, you got like a little Merry Christmas on the side there, so that's kind of cool. They got some different wooden ones as well. So definitely some different oh, options. So we'll see which one uh, we decide to pick up today. So we, uh, we found our sleigh, stay tuned. Uh, like I said, we're kind of working on a little dio piece with Father Christmas and everything. So if you uh, have a guess which sleigh I picked up, was it the Merry Christmas? Was it the red? Was it the silver? And uh, stay tuned to find out which one we got. We're gonna drop this off at the car and then we're gonna go to Ollie's, see if we can find some good stuff cheap. We're at Ollie's, it's Matthews, North Carolina. Let's go. Um, Hasbro at Ollie's, there's our Transformers. We've seen plenty of Rhinox. And you can see a little Avengers signage. So we got Hulk, Spider-Man, got Captain America, some of our basic figures. Little uh, block town there. Dungeons and Dragons. Little Captain Marvel going on. Look at our uh, Toy Story 4, Mr. Potato Head. All kinds of toys. Look at that guy. A couple vehicles. Some dinosaurs. Watch right past. Uh, couple Jurassic World going on there. I don't think we're gonna see that big uh, Motu display. <laughs> that was at uh, one of our other locations. But uh, maybe we'll luck out and they'll get some Motu in. Got some Ghostbusters here. Look at all the Ecto-1s. Some basic Ghostbusters. Uh, I have no idea what that thing's supposed to be. What is this? Ghostbusters. Uh, ghost Whistle. I have no idea why this didn't sell in stores, right? Everybody wants a Ghost Whistle, right? Uh, I got some Battle Cat, but not too much more. Where's all those figures at, right? This way it has uh, it's been a busy retail day for sure lots of people out there's that black widow there's some more black widow figures shang chi game of thrones star wars jumanji squirrel girl got our ronin Little MCU figure as well. There's some more Spider-Man figures. Let's see what else? All kinds of dolls if you're looking for different characters. Power Rangers, still got uh, the pumpkin wrapper, still got our King Sphinx. John Cena, if you can see him. Got his WWE t-shirt. Who else is back there? Little Bobby the Brain Heaton. Looks like some Chinas. Uh, what is that? Uh, yeah, China. So, army build your John Cena's. Nobody will see your army. Ultimate army of John Cena's. Army of Grogu. <laughs> Little Grogu Ocean. And they got plenty of holiday stuff here as well. Maybe we could have found a sled. There's some more Disney toys. Uh, let's see, is there anything down? 15% off. Yeah, it's just that Motu stuff. All right, let's go see what else we can find. Little Barbie end cap. Got a few cars, vehicles. 
LOL. Doctor Who, got those little bronze dragons. Some more Jurassic World. Ratatouille, some basic Marvels. Lando, $5.99, looks like all Lando's there. Some Pixar, a little bit of Tech Deck, Ninja Turtles, Minions, Shanna Baszler, some Big John Stud, Space Jam. Definitely seeing quite a bit of Space Jam at the different Ollie's stores. Archie, little Super 7. Still got our Raw 10. Plenty of Lando there. Little WWE 2 pack, some basic G.I. Joe. Basic Avengers. Kinds of basic Avengers, Transformers. Check out a uh, little Endor Luke. That's kind of cool. Got a couple of those. A couple little Transformers. All right, so there is some Mo2, but I don't imagine. Yeah, it's just the Battle Cat and the little two pack. Panthor, the uh, Sky Sled. So, yeah, probably not the Motu. I know a lot of people got some of this stuff on clearance, so a lot better prices at Walmart. Um, and some Nerf and some Hot Wheels. All right, I think that's going to do it for our Ollie's. Finished up at Ollie's, no pickups. Uh, I didn't see any sled, sleigh options. So <laughs> I'm still pretty happy with our Hobby Lobby pickup. We're, uh, yeah, having fun here in Matthews, North Carolina, looking for some different stuff. Uh, I don't know if we're going to see any more new things at Ollie's, but I'll keep uh, checking. Let me know if you are finding some awesome deals, getting some good stuff at Ollie's. I think we're going to go back to our norm. We are on our way to Target in Matthews, North Carolina, and uh, let's go see if we can find something new there. Let's go, Target run. Matthews, North Carolina, we're at Target. Target run, here we go. With our collector spot today, we got uh, Candyman there. A little anime, Friday the 13th, Creep Show. There's Piccolo, some aliens, Shuri. So, not bad. I feel like the spot keeps getting smaller and smaller. Gremlins, there you go, a little Christmas hat, a little cane, perfect for this time of the year. He's also got uh, some different Christmas toys for you in the pack. Dragons, little turtles versus Stranger Things. There's our toy soldier. Miss Marvel. Hamilton. Look at the little Spider Man ornament. Halloween 2. Witcher. So quite a bit jammed into our little spot. Let's go see what else we can find today. We got a little end cap here, some statues, little demon slayer, little uh, my hero. Oh, that's kind of cool. So got so yeah, some different anime. Statues going on, a Pokemon sets, plushies, so uh, new video game and anime. Check it out. In Toronto, we got some dinosaurs there. Looks like we got a little bit of a deal going on. Not much longer though, this video might post by the time, or might not post by the time 
the sale is over so definitely check out target see if they got some new deals up nine pack got our 20 pack a couple exclusive cars there not much a lot of empty pegs or hot wheels a lot of tracks getting cleared out Got a few, yeah, a couple Pokemon down there. Holiday Pokemon as well. Some Batman. A little bit of Mario Kart. Some monster trucks going on, but yeah, look at those empty pegs. We do have a little matchbox set there. More Harleys going on. But yeah, it looks like a lot of stuff getting scooped up, which makes sense this time of year. There's some monster trucks set up there. More dinosaurs. Big old dinosaurs, right? Little dinosaurs. Got some light here. He man, 40 years, pig man, little masters of the universe, masterverse 40. There's some of our newer avatar figures. And starting to see those hit the shelves. So I feel like the first wave was kind of like the first movie and now we're starting to see some of the second movie stuff hitting stores. Retro Star Wars. There's our little uh, Ahsoka. We got Lando up there couple holiday warriors now this is a fun one to find check that out our commander clone commander cody that is pretty cool to see probably was uh chilling in the back somewhere got some boba fett plenty of dark troopers a couple of kenobis up there uh, let's roll back around. Bodacious Bagman. Little Sonic Tails. Mario. All kinds of stuff just around. Minecraft. Ooh, little Chucky set there. Fortnite. Roblox. It's like a little restock of our Halo figures. Let's slide around. Halo shorts. Definitely a lot of people today. A lot of people trying to do some navigating. Look at this Power Rangers. A little blue Ranger there. That's kind of cool. Green Ranger. Wild Force Blue Ranger. Got like the shark design. Got like the teeth on the helmet. Interesting. Uh, let's see. Green Ranger here. That's kind of cool. See, I don't know if those are new, but first time I've kind of notice them like i said the little shark teeth kind of stick out with uh with that guy pink ranger there's a yellow ranger it's cool a couple power rangers for you got our robin there if you want to build a horse transformers our Blitzwing, Starscream, but not much with the Transformers. Ah, uh, there's that Red Hood. 
Yeah, maybe if I get him on clearance, but don't think I'll be scooping him up today. Debating on the head sculpt, King Shazam, a Martian Manhunter, Super 7, G.I. Joes. Got some Marvel Universe, little Captain America, Iron Man, Moon Knight, Spider-Man. So those look pretty cool. U.S. Agent, got our Quake, Kate Bishop, got our Hawkeye, still haven't picked up our Peter and Ned, keep an eye out for that, Miss Marvel there, got a little bit of Mario and Sonic, there's our Christmas Gremlins. Got their little candy cane, their gingerbread going on as well. A couple of turtles, aliens, some plushies, gargoyles. Got that April. All right, let's go. I think we can slide down now. Ace Ventura there. Defenders of Earth. There's our Demona. Got She-Hulk. And Mr. Knight. There's the old man. Ralphie. Definitely seen some fun pictures with uh, Ralphie from the toy community. Uh, let's see. Yeah. There's Splinter. We saw some of these turtles in our last hunt video. I don't know if he was hidden back there, but there is Splinter. Our last target uh, video we found like Bebop Rocksteady found Shredder. So that's cool to see Splinter there. All right, let's see. We can get this navigating. Definitely a lot of people today just trying to get into this last little corner here. See if we got any wrestlers. Roman Reigns, Jeff Hardy, Ray Mysterio there, ABA. W figures, still got the madness, look at all the shore troopers, all the imperial officers, still got our dinosaurs that we saw last time. We've also been seeing this little Minecraft set. Oh, I guess they're different ones, so Steve and then Creeper. There's all the dinos that we saw before. So yeah, definitely check out those Target stores. There's our little anime. Ooh, I don't know that I've seen this guy before. Yeah, that guy is uh, a little scary looking. So some different Godzilla figures. All right, I think that's gonna do it for Target. Target run, and we are all food. Ooh, man, all finished. Whew, all finished. No pickups. Definitely a lot of people, <laughs> a lot of people in Matthew's uh, great area to look for stuff, the holidays. But that is going to conclude the toy hunt portion of this video. We did pick up a uh, sled for our Father Christmas Mythic well, not really Mythic Legions figure. Obscurus from Four Horsemen. Yeah, we could talk more about, uh, you know, stuff. Star Wars. There was uh, there was some things on the shelves. Hot Wheels getting cleaned out. Uh, we saw, you know, a few things over at Ollie's. But I am excited for Father Christmas. Let's get to the toy garage and uh, let's put together a little Father Christmas, a little Dio scene, and uh, maybe some other figures, figures,
from uh, Four Horsemen. So let's go. Power of YouTube, power of editing. Let's go. Welcome back. We are in the toy garage. And here he is. He has arrived. It's Father Christmas. Uh, what a surprise from Four Horsemen coming off a great headless horseman release and uh who knew in 2022 we uh we needed this figure this is awesome and a great way to kind of finish up the year figure obscurus this is so cool uh i'm sure you've seen plenty of reviews by now but uh just a cool packaging Got the uh, little Christmas card as well. So that is so cool. Guess what? We got a sleigh. Which sleigh did we choose? It's silver. But if we turn it around, did you select... The Merry Christmas. So I like this because uh, it's got like the red, the black, the white on there. Uh, I was a little concerned at first because this is kind of like a paperish material. So a lot of them were kind of ruined. Like, uh, I don't know if there were some kind of stickers on them when they were delivered, but you could see the pattern kind of ripped and torn. I was able to find this one that was in pretty good condition and I uh, decided that that would be the sled for Santa. So Father Christmas, little Merry Christmas on the sled. I think that works out well. We're going to uh, open up Father Christmas and uh, hopefully some fun stuff inside. Let's go. Tell me one thing. Is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. So I think it'd be easier to kind of talk through this stuff while it's uh, all wrapped up. A lot easier. So we got our little surprise bag if you have not seen what's inside the uh, surprise bag uh definitely spoilers i'll give you like you know a couple more seconds to uh go ahead and leave but i imagine most of you have seen what's inside the bag first off Maybe not a huge surprise. Little Ducky. Yeah, who doesn't want a little Ducky? And how about, oh yeah. So this was a nice little holiday treat. We got a helmet. This is typically a 2.0 helmet. Came with like the iron knight and uh what was the other one the steel knight so that is pretty cool upsize that helmet so it fits on the 1.0 bigger we got wolf how cool is that and we got another helmet i don't know if this is a new design or again if it was something that was kind of enlarged but that is cool now another fun thing about father christmas uh there is a neck peg it's kind of an adapter if you didn't know, Father Christmas is a 2.0 body, which typically the 2.0 bodies are smaller. So an example of our 2.0, there you go. Give you an idea of that body type compared to 
a 1.0 and you can see definitely a little bit of size difference there i know some people are making their father christmas more of a santa claus by fitting the soft goods to a 1.0 body for me uh father christmas i'm thinking more of uh you know kind of wizardy sorcery little christmas magic versus uh the big old santa claus maybe uh you see at the mall that type of thing uh i'm thinking more like your mythology maybe like odin like thor kind of on that road versus a traditional santa claus maybe with our second head sculpt you got like the shorter beard and stuff maybe eventually we'll make like a santa claus i think there'll be enough uh christmas style red white gold black stuff out there where if you wanted to make a 1.0 and keep the 2.0 you know that would be easy enough i think the biggest thing with the 1.0 you just want to be careful with those soft goods you might have to make and a little adjustment with the belt i haven't seen anybody do anything like big old stomach wise yet in like pictures and stuff but uh as far as like you can get that bigger like puffier chest kind of like you saw in the two figures you get just a little bit of a more muscular body bigger frame which um if you're going for santa claus yeah bigger frame makes sense so we got uh the two crowns which is pretty cool uh, to my knowledge, they are exactly the same. It was just one of those deals where they put in two. So if you wanted, you have one for each head sculpt, which kind of works out nice. You got the cane stick, which uh, I think is cool. You can add the lamp to it and a nice design with the gold and kind of the candle lit is so cool. We got uh, the bag of toys there, our little base for our tree, little trumpet, little drums, little elf. So yeah, tons of stuff that uh, came with this figure. So I just got, uh, I guess what you'd consider the standard edition. There was uh, some different sets. Like I think one came with like a mug and stuff. So just depending on how you wanna celebrate the uh four horsemen and uh you can pick up some additional swag to go with santa check out this awesome piece so just like with the headless horsemen these are on magnets and it like magnetizes to the box so you have this awesome uh just like background piece that uh, you can definitely have some fun with uh, definitely a snowman right there. So maybe a future release. We also have uh, Black Krampus, which I think was the first release of the figure, Obscurus. And uh, eventually we'll have uh, the red Krampus coming. And uh, I think I'll use both of the Krampus figures and father christmas and kind of put together a display right now we just have black krampus so i'll have to see how i can fit him and father christmas together but tons of accessories let me know in the comments uh if you scooped up this figure from four horsemen uh as far as picking this up on as far as retail uh, four horsemen or sourcehorsemen.com go to their shop if you're interested in picking up this figure i feel like this is one of those things where you could possibly just scoop up this figure and you don't have to go down <laughs> the large rabbit hole of mythic legions or cosmic legions uh the obscurus is fun like i said they're only 
about four figures in. So you have the Headless Horseman and his steed. You got uh, both of the Krampus now and then uh, Father Christmas. We'll see in 2023 what releases we'll get. Uh, if you are a fan of this line or you uh, just want to play the game, let me know in the comments what other figure obscurus characters would you like to see in future releases welcome back and we got it all set up there is our merry christmas sleigh we got the moose the moose is loose uh our team put it together uh my good awesome uh Father Christmas himself, my dad, uh, doing some little chain hookup there with our Adlar. So we got the chain kind of running to our Merry Christmas. So a little family treat putting this together. Uh, I love the little display cutout uh, moose and uh, <laughs> taking up a little bit of it, but it's still cool to kind of have there in the background got our tree in the mix uh father christmas got the little elf in his pocket rocking the crown got the cane with uh the light and we got our toys kind of hanging there and i have uh the krampus kind of loading up the display because we don't have any elves yet. I do not have any elves. I have some dark elves. That would have been kind of funny. <laughs> Santa, Santa and the dark elves, right? I guess Krampus isn't much better. I got uh, the one just kind of in the sleigh loading things up. And then uh, the second one, he might be ready to go uh, find some <laughs> naughty kids, right? And then we got our little wolf and our ducky out so really cool uh the other thing i wanted to show you all i took a round shield soldier and i put the other father christmas head on there and uh shorter beard but uh pretty cool you do have to consider with the beard what kind of like guards and stuff you put on the body. But uh, just another example of a 1.0 body versus our 2.0. Uh, Father Christmas is definitely gonna be a little smaller on that 2.0 body. And then we bring in our little helmets, which look great with that particular armor fingers crossed i would say my christmas wish for 2023 would be a re-release more round shield soldiers would be perfect to go with those head sculpts that we just got uh fingers crossed never know never say never but uh, I will definitely be on the lookout. Uh, one of my favorite like night pieces. So hopefully we can get more of those in the future. But let me know. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Smash that like button, comment, and share. Is there a Christmas gift you're looking forward to getting or giving this year? Uh, this is going to be an awesome, awesome piece for me for uh, hopefully years to come. I'm hoping to figure out a shelf display and I'll probably have Father Christmas, Krampus, our red Krampus all together uh, just chilling on a shelf during the year. And uh, I think that's going to be a fun look back to 2022 and uh this first year of four horsemen for me and first year of mythic legions 
Smash that like button, comment, and share. If you haven't already, jump into Kent Pool Collects. We're having a lot of fun here on YouTube. Also over on Instagram, Kent Pool Collects. If you're having trouble finding stuff in your area, or you're like me and you just want to scoop up some Mythic Legions and have them sent to your home, check out Big Bad Toy Store. Link in the description. Big Bad Toy Store. Uh, I can't imagine how many Christmas gifts they are probably doing this year. And if you want to add to your collection, whether it's Mythic Legions, Hot Toys, Marvel Legends, G.I. Joe Classified Series, McFarlane, all kinds of great stuff on Big Bad Toy Store. Go check them out. If you want to help out the channel, just go hit the link, take a look. You don't even have to buy anything. And uh, thank you to our subscribers. I hope you all are enjoying the holidays. We're getting closer and closer to Christmas. Hopefully a Merry Christmas for everybody. Don't stress yourself out trying to find those gifts. Uh, just find some time to uh, share with the important people in your life and uh, some holiday cheer. Hopefully you get to enjoy and share like I get to. And thank you to our channel members. Uh, Y'all have been a gift uh, just by supporting the channel. And it's always so positive, so awesome to uh, see you all as channel members. And thank you. Until next time, always be hunting. Oh, have fun cool. do, we will be all right. These Come true.